930, with the town of Vail at the center of a controversy after a Colorado artist and member of the Standing Rock Sioux Tribe was dropped from her artist residency. And this comes after she posted one of her works, which compared the plight of Native Americans to that of Palestinians in Gaza. Fox 31's Rachel Sauer has both sides of that story tonight. All new at 9. Rachel. Yeah, Talia and Jeremy. Well, the artist says this violates her First Amendment rights to express herself as an artist, while the Jewish community says that what she posted on social media crosses a line. At the beginning of the year, the town of Vail reached out to a Colorado artist, Danielle Seawalker, to feature her in the summer 2024 artist residency program. I really wanted to um, have diversity be part of that and really centered it into their programming. C. Walker, a member of the Standing Rock Sioux Tribe, says the town of Vail thought she would be a good addition to their programming. The residency was slated to begin in early June and um, I was notified in May, um, just a few weeks before, that um, they were canceling it. The reason the town of Vail gave for canceling the residency centered around this art piece titled G is for genocide. And I just was very shocked and stunned. Like, what what does this mean? I'm not, you know, I'm I'm not trying to be political. Vail posted on their Facebook page back in May that this came from many in the community voicing concerns on the rhetoric about her views on the Israel Hamas war. She wrote on her social media page that she wanted to divest and dismantle, which what are you divesting and what are you dismantling? Israel? C. Walker in the ACLU of Colorado says this is free speech and the town of Vail should not have dropped her. The government can't then punish her for those views. But some in the Jewish community say this crosses a line. Even if it's something that would be covered under the First Amendment um, or they're, they were, you know, saying Jews should go to the ovens or Heil Hitler, right? The town will be like, yeah, we definitely don't want this person representing our town. Seth Levy, who serves on the Jewish Community Relations Council, says despite that, he was surprised to learn how quickly the town dropped the residency program. Is that over the line? I think that's something that should be open for debate. In the meantime, the ACLU says they are intending to sue the town of Vail for an undisclosed amount of money. I think it's important that they know that they can't do that, that there are limits imposed by the Constitution. Yeah, Fox 31 has reached out to the town of Vail for comment, and they say they are aware a lawsuit has been filed, but they have not been served, and they c cannot comment on pending or active litigation. Back to you guys. All right, uh, Rachel, thank you. New here.